But we're rolling into Belmont's Revenge. We got a Mega Man style stage select between four stages. Let's start with the Crystal Castle. I'm gonna bump down audio a little bit. It is a little bit loud in my ears. There's Castlevania. What do you want me to say about it? Ow. It's Castlevania, and I'm just as bad as ever, apparently. Oh, fuck. Oh, god damn it. I'm gonna take that as a sign. T get the bird out of here. Okay, I need... Well, I don't need you to respawn, yet here we are. Oh my god. I'm gonna die to this stupid bird. Not even gonna get to the hard stuff. Gonna die to the bird. Well, isn't that the Castlevania experience? Now that I will take. Now we essentially have a, uh, ranged weapon. Got a fireball projectile. Very handy. I want that holy water. I don't care if I'm wasting time trying to get it, I want holy water and you're not gonna stop me, game. That's just points. That I don't care about. I could go down there, but... Eh, actually, I could think of a reason. Is that more gonna kill me now that I think about when if I go in it? I hope it doesn't. Probably does, though. So, uh, we're just gonna not go down there, like, ever. does feel a bit slow at times, but probably just because it's a Game Boy game. Hi. Oh, hey, a 1-Up. Wasn't expecting to find that there. Yes, it, it is a Castlevania game, which means you are obligated to whip any wall you come across. You never know when, in this case a 1-Up, but more commonly, a fork shop might be hiding. Slide down the rope faster. Get out of here onto the next screen. Is there like. Ah! Oh, there was a pork shop, but I couldn't get it because I'm bad. That figures, but okay. I'm sure there will be another one we might be able to get. I hope there is anyway. Alright. From block to block, don't let them crumble under your feet. Okay, I can kill you while you're still submerged in the water. Good to know. Oh, I, I don't have holy water anymore. Okay, guess we're gonna have to make do with this axe. Okay. No pork shop to be found. Welcome to the let's whip every wall imaginable course part of this game. Oh, I think we're shit out of luck. Well, I want I want to try one more wall. Can I whip 
this. Aha! Found you. Stinking pork chop. Dang wall chicken. And not a moment too soon. Looks like we're going into into the boss fight. Okay, boss. Ah. You really needed to show up right smack in the middle, did you? This is a pretty easy boss, just land some hits. Get out of the way of the cloud. Rinse and repeat. Of course, you're on your last hit, too. There. Hey, extra life. Yeah, because there are extra lives to points, so... <laughs> maybe we can start stocking up on those lives. Or maybe we'll just lose them all in the next stage, who knows. Let's go into the next stage, though. The Cloud Castle. Okay, this stage. This is an interesting stage. So you see those mountains in the background? So I'm playing this on an analog pocket. So, and I learned about this. I think I learned about this through My Life and Game because they use this game as the example. So I turned flame, frame blending on for this game specifically because when it's off, they're flashing. But if I have it on, they're not flashing. It looks pretty all right. I usually leave frame, frame blending off uh, but this is one instance where I wanted to have it on, just so those mountains weren't flashing. That's something I thought I'd show off, especially for anybody else who might ha be inclined to play this game on an analog pocket, so that doesn't look weird and dumb. But as far as, at least as far as my knowledge goes, so few games have a problem like that where you gotta turn on frame blending, and I prefer how the game looks with frame blending off, so that's usually what I stick to. Whip you out of here. Whip you out of here. I need to wait, I need to wait. No problems whatsoever with that, oh boy. Okay, easy. Gotta go, yep, we gotta go down to go up. Just what you want want to see. Uh, the stage itself isn't... Whoops. Shouldn't have said anything. This looks like a screen with some potential for there to be a uh, pork chop on it. So once we clear out the enemies, we'll do some investigating. Nope. Nope. Maybe not. Alright, forget it. We'll go pork chopless for a little while longer, I suppose. The bigger... 
hazard with this game is making sure you don't impale yourself on spikes, because that hurts like a motherfuck. It's very easy to accidentally do that to yourself. I thought there was actually going to be a pork shop there. Oh well. Moving right along. Three HP left. Oh, and I am never a fan of fighting you. Okay. Unless there's a pork chop really soon, I think we're going to be taking a death, but that's okay. I tried to jump! He didn't jump! Okay, that's fine. I'm already over it. Almost didn't jump again. What the hell? At least we did make the jump that time. Mmm, I want to climb up higher. Okay. Boop. Uh, you know what? I have an axe. So it makes more sense to just take care of you while you're up there. Instead of cause, uh, infinite sadness for myself. Oh, looks like we're going into the boss area. Care of the bat. I really could have used a bit more sub weapon, but okay. I guess holy water is what we're working with now. They're really just like no pork chop ever. I guess not. Okay. Well, let's tackle the boss. I can take the hits. That boss is a pretty simple damage tank and you'll get through probably. Easy. Can't believe how easy it was when I didn't jump into spikes. Okay, let's tackle this stage next. Plant Castle. Third stage on the bucket list, and we get our fireballs back. Life is good. Four extra lives so far. Okay. Not that it really matters, because we do have unlimited continues in this game. Uh, but being able to beat the game without having to use a continue is usually a pretty good feeling. I like can can you like not though? I don't want to go up there. I have a feeling if I try to take the high road, I'm going to just find myself jumping into spikes and it's going to be a not fun time. Oh 
god, the revenge of eyeballs. Why? Why did it have to be eyeballs? Well, they were mostly on the top path, so... Was a simple enough matter. And what? Oh god. Is this gonna be like a rope maze? Oh, that's gonna blow ass. Oh, hey, meat. I like meat. Meat is good for you. Oh god, hi skeleton. Did not expect you to be invading the rope I was invading. I'm just climb. Oh god. Hi, big ass bat. Bye, big ass bat. I should have thrown holy water at you, but eh, this works all right enough, I guess. Oh god. Oh, and you take my hearts if you hit me. That's cool. Okay. At least there's meat there. Make it feel better. But, I also have no ammo for my holy water anymore. So these eyeballs also do blow up, blow up this type of bridge. So... Don't want to destroy too many segments. Better if we can avoid them, rather than face them head on. Now this part... I mean, there's spikes that we would have to avoid if we stuck to the top path. I am in no mood to do that. So, how about... We don't do that. Oh boy, spiders. We like spiders, right? Well, their web, as it may be... And be used <laughs> as something to climb on. How it works, don't ask me. But it works, so you know that's all that's all we really need. We're coming up on the boss. You can usually tell you're coming up on the boss when you go through a door and the music stops. We're back to eyeball land. And I didn't make the jump! Cool! I forgot how tight that jump connect is, actually. So that's a good way to die. Making that mistake. An absolute... Rookie mistake. What even is in here? Oh, it's just an axe. I don't care about the axe. I want to at least get my whip powered up, though. I imagine the game isn't going to be so cruel as to not let that happen. Yeah, there's a power up. I would have wanted fireballs as well, but you know, take what you can get, really. The axe would have also helped, to be fair. Alrighty, bossy boss. I can whip the projectiles, which is good info. I am not gonna catch that platform. Nope. Damn. I should be able to catch this one, though. We 
mean, we've got enough health. It's just gonna be waiting for things to happen there. Get out of here. And we got an extra life. All right, three stages down. One to go. Rock Castle. Oh, yeah, this looks like a rock castle, I suppose. Thank God for holy water. Holy water so uh, solving all of life's problems. That causing all of life's problems. Oh, well, this isn't too bad so far. Oh, it, no, I shouldn't have said anything. These jerks that hop around like no tomorrow. They are motherfucks. Careful not to get stabbed. Okay. That's not so bad when you're ready for it. But it's something that can definitely blindside you if you're not ready for it. Alright, on, on to the next one. I don't like the look of this. Not one bit. Okay. That's actually not that bad. I always things I don't like how they look. And then I do things and... Oh, that's not so bad. I gotta... Wait for a few of these to poke out. Yep. And then go. Oh, right, that's the gimmick. Man, I love when candles are, you know, they do candle- Ah! That's- Ow. But yeah, the idea is, um, as long as there's a candle on screen, we can see where we're going, but the moment there's no candle on screen, uh, we're in trouble. So don't blow the lights out. <laughs> That's my sound advice. as fast as humanly possible. Hmm. We just like, yeah, we can just break this. If there's something there, well, like a pork chop or something, well, we're not getting any more. But we do have an axe now. That counts for something. Uh, trying to get that angle correct is uh, not gonna happen so easily. We'll just 
whip you the old-fashioned way. Hi. Okay, boss. I assume this is the boss anyway. Me meet? I definitely leaped into the wall for a second. Oh, I probably shouldn't think too hard about it. Alrighty, boss. Well, the first phase was easy. Second phase, on the other hand, not so much. Might be in trouble. Never mind, we're good. With one HP to spare. Cut that close. Alright, welcome to Endgame. You'll enjoy your stay here. Now the Dracula's castle has shown up. I can get behind this music. I'm gonna need to add this music into the playlist. I've been slacking on adding music to the uh, to the stream playlist lately, mostly because I have not had a lot of free time lately, especially like this week because uh, I basically had like either I've had to go to work or I've been doing stream related stuff or setting up stuff for Retro Book Club. Um, MFF has taken up my time. I started playing 14 it with a friend, and that's also taken up some of my time. So it's just been like a busy week of everything. Oh yeah, and also still recovering from the the flooded basement because I have like I got a new shell put in. But I haven't really sat down to put games on it. I started to work on that. But I'm probably going to have to continue work on that, uh, like, over the weekend. E scheduling anything is a nightmare, basically. And I have a mystery triathlon match tomorrow as well to worry about. Thankfully that tournament is coming to its close. Uh, which means I don't have to think about any tournaments for probably a while after that. But my run could and honestly probably will end tomorrow in that tournament. Um, but even if it doesn't... Even if I do win, the next match is Grand Finals, so... Win or lose, it's ending then. And there was just like a period of time near the end of last month, where, or not last month, last year, where it's just like I had... Hey, more meat. Four different tournaments just like keep tabs on and it was just ooh, it was rough my mentality basically started to become uh okay just schedule as many matches as humanly possible and get as far as i can in like every tournament so i don't have to think about scheduling a match for as long as possible 
And I did really well in all four of them as well. Um, which meant I had to keep scheduling matches. And sometimes it be like that. Oh god, I made a mistake. I made a horrible mistake. Okay, uh, this is a big problem now. Yep. Like I said, big problem. How are we... Oh, we're still doing really good on lives. Still have four extra lives. Give orb. Oh. Okay, let's... Eh, holy water might be... Oh, God. Whip the skeleton... Don't walk into the skeleton. Sound advice, I would say. Two, three. Drop it down on the platform, and let's get out of here. Get out of here and on to the next... Oh, there was meat right there. Of course. Uh, whatever. That's just how it be. Ah! Fuck me. I thought that holy water was gonna do enough to kill. What an idiot I was. Oh, but now I don't have holy water for the screen. Hmm. Mmm, that's some spice. I think I can still get you nor the normal way. Yeah. More big ass bats. Alrighty, boss. How hard you want a boss today? Oh, like anytime you want to get out of here, thank you. Just need one more hit on you. That'll do. Easy boss. Every boss is easy. And another extra life. Just keeping those extra lives coming. All right. On to the next part of Dracula's castle. Starting immediately with getting our fireballs back. Like to see that, like to see that. Long before I lose it, though. Just gotta keep a cool head and keep whipping my way through. That's all I've done to get to this point. Why stop now? I would like a sub weapon, though. It's like the only thing I'm missing as of right now. Hey, there you go. Asking you shall receive. No oil water is always good to have for some just general damage. 
because you can just throw it down onto something and they just take damage repeatedly. It's great. Hmm, that's not what I want to see. That, however, is you dying. And I guess we have an axe now. Okay. I mean, I can make this work. Hey! Meat. Neat meat. So good we have to do it a second time. Alright. What's up next? Oh. Pseudo armor. Okay, well, goodbye. Anything in this candle? Is it just... Oh, it's just a heart. Okay, well... Wasted a little bit of ammunition to get that, but... At least my curiosity has been satisfied. I guess that's... Some badge of honor. On to the next part. Of course, we've got more conveyor ro ropes. I know it's more mechanisms, but I just think of them as conveyor ropes because of Donkey Kong Country. Not completely inaccurate, after all. Mmm. So close. I was worried I was not going to be able to grab the rope for a second. It was going to make me very angry. <laughs> it's going to take a lot of meaningless damage. It was going to be great. Oh my god, bat, please! Bats are the worst. I know this is an established fact. But it continues to be the truth. Bats are the worst. Right up there with birds. Alright, now to wait for that. Oh god! Okay, there's a- I did not realize there was a bonus room here. Okay. Well, what do we have here? Meat? Okay. So not a whole lot, but... Kinda interesting there's a bonus room there. I actually didn't even know that was there. I just accidentally went up there and... Oh cool, bonus room. Yeah, there's a one up there, but getting it is pain. <laughs> well, the bird. Mind the crumbling blocks. For some reason, the sound effect that plays when the blocks crumble, it kind of reminds me of them being like ice blocks. I don't know if that's just me thinking aloud or if that's actually what they're supposed to be, because, you know, so much you can represent with only four colors. Uh, that's a mistake. Let's go back a little bit and respawn that spider. That spider. I don't need to kill this spider. I can just go normally.
<sighs> okay. I think there was meat above the door as well if we needed it, but we're at full health already. So I don't think we need it. Alright, time for a boss fight. Alright, you made it this far. The rebirth of Dracula will occur soon. You cannot destroy me, father. We'll see about that. trouble. Damn it. Last hit, too. Damn. How are we doing on lives? We still got three. Okay. That should be enough to get through this fight, because this is not an easy fight. And they load me well enough for this fight. Like, it's not especially great, but it's a workable amount. They gave me holy water and a whip upgrade, which are the two main things I need. Okay, we don't need to see this text again. We're gonna... maybe not do that. Ow. Okay, easy. Just avoid things. Never get hit. And get an extra life in the process. Ouch. That's all you have to say is, ouch. What am I doing? Oh, father. Since Dracula cannot use my powers, Dracula will use the power of the four castle spirits. Hurry up, quickly. A real final stage. And the real final battle at that. Get fully powered up. Let's get let's get to work here. So this game is a fun game of memory because you got to figure out all, all the safe spots to stand to avoid this attack but based on where he's spawning from and I know where at least some of them, that it that is not one of them I think this one is duck here yep this one what I like to do is stand here when he launches them out jump to the right One should be hiding. Oh, I had to hide on the right side of the platform, but that's the right general idea. Whip, and uh, didn't jump fast enough. So I'm probably gonna take a death. Maybe not if I get lucky. Shit, 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 yep. I remembered where the safe spot was for when he's there a little too late. And that's how it be. 
But we got pretty close on the first attempt, so I think we can go all the way this time. Get Drax ass. Attempt number two. I believe the safe spot, when you're there, is... Yeah, it's, like, right down here. Come on, really? Oh, god damn it, me. Forgetting how to play video games here. What kind of a nerd am I? Okay. This is hide down here. It looks like Drax spawns the same order every time. God. Thought I avoided that. Oh, nope. Tried to walk off the platform, didn't quite walk off. Still have two lives, but I want to try to do this game without using a continue. Anyway, this is just a boss fight. There's no, like, real stage. All right, third time's the charm, Drac. It's right here, yep. That's where you want to stand to stay safe. This is here. Now you go down here. And just dodge that successfully. We go over there. Hide down here. Now we're learning. You go, yep, you go up again. And I think now the pattern repeats. You're gonna go to the bottom left. And we hide down here. We hide here. I'm not gonna chance it. And you go. Oh, you go here next. And the next place you warp to, we finish you off. See? Didn't even take a hit. And that is GG. That's Castlevania 2 finished. Like any good Castlevania game, Dracula's cra castle cr crumbling away. The war is over. Boy, is it. Dracula's scheme was... Oiled. Because of... The combined... Power of Christopher Sully, you 
once again, the world is at peace until Dracula rises once again. And then... Solyu has overcome the Dark Curse. And will continue to fight. Well, good for him. Dracula and his forces... I forgot how slowly this text scrolls. Holy moly. Soon after, the Belmont family has a long history of vampire hunters. A legend will always continue. I guess we get credits now? Yep. Oh god, the credits also scroll very slowly. Man! It's okay. We'll just enjoy the credits. At least we have beaten... Castlevania, so that's one less game in my Game Boy backlog now. Now only like 90 more games to go, except by the time I get through those 90 games, I'm gonna have like another 90. <laughs> I've played some Game Boy Castlevania games. From my understanding, uh, Castlevania The Adventure is not really uh, a good one, but this one is pretty alright for a uh, Game Boy Castlevania game, I'd say. I think I picked this one up at, like, a store. I mean, like, most games, but... They just happened to get this in, and I'm like, sure, why not? I don't have a, any Castlevania Game Boy games yet. Well, that's the backlog and play it like a year later, and that's basically exactly what happened. And I believe we're now stuck on the screen until we power off the console. <laughs> 